Meanwhile, in Indonesia, the country's Chamber of Commerce and Industry is projecting a 6% growth in the logistics sector this year. And this growth within the logistics sector is hoped to give a boost to other economic sectors in Indonesia in this climate of deep uncertainty. Businesses within the maritime transportation and logistics sectors of the four ASEAN countries, namely Brunei, Indonesia, Malaysia and the Philippines, are coming together to consolidate in Jakarta from the 21st to the 23rd of February 2023 to increase regional economic competitiveness, focusing on the growth in the commerce and investment sectors among ASEAN countries. The head of logistics and supply chain of the Indonesian Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Akbar Johan, said the potential of sea, air and land logistics in Indonesia is tremendous, as much as 2,000 trillion rupiah to be exact, and it is targeted to continue growing by over 6% this year. Johan is also optimistic that sea-based logistics can contribute 20 to 30% of the logistics sector's total potential this year. Ekonomi yang berputar kalau kita bicara logistik ekosistemnya itu tidak kurang daripada 2000 triliun ya baik itu dari maritimenya artinya dari moda transport lautnya udaranya bahkan daratnya hinterlandnya nah ini kurang lebih 2000 triliun ya kita juga agak terlalu muluk-muluk paling tidak lebih bagus daripada sebelum pandemik ya Pak Nova ya jadi kalau kita bisa grab 20-30 persen daripada total potensi ekonomi dari bisnis logistik uh, integrated ini sudah sangat uh, memberikan harapan baru ya di atas daripada uh, pendapatan ataupun revenue uh, 3-4 tahun sebelumnya. Meanwhile, Chairman of the Standing Committee for Sea Transportation of Indonesia's Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Nova Mugijanto, announced that the committee will open new export routes to increase the volume of trade and investments in Indonesia. Mainly investments in the rejuvenation of domestic fleets, seeing as many of them are 15 years old and over. Kita tahu tahun 2023 itu kan akan ada krisis ya, sehingga kita harus kreatif lah dalam hal ini untuk lebih banyak membuka jalur-jalur baru. Kira-kira seperti itu. Nah kalau kita bicara secara total itu uh, memang Sekarang kalau Indonesia sudah 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 kembali kepada sebelum pandemi ya kalau kita bicara mengenai domestik ya nah, sekarang gimana caranya supaya uh, ekspornya itu kita bisa lebih banyak. The Maritime Forum of Brunei, Indonesia, Malaysia and the Philippines East ASEAN Growth Area, or better known as BIMP EAGA, was established in 1994 to promote and facilitate trade and economic growth in the four mentioned four ASEAN countries. The yearly consolidation meeting that will be held in Jakarta this February is hoped to be a driver of economic recovery and help ASEAN countries weather the storm of uncertainty this year.